Justin Trudeau arrived for a meeting of Caribbean leaders met by the men and women the Bahamas hopes to send to Haiti, police, and or members of their defense force. Canada is facing pressure to do more. Haiti is already a failed state. Former Governor General Mikhail Jean came to Canada from Haiti as a refugee. She told CBC News's Power and Politics Haiti should be a key focus of the summit. They cannot do it alone. Uh, they will need also Canada to be on board and to and, and to support, you know, uh, these actions. After decades of corruption and poverty, Haiti has descended into chaos since the assassination of Haitian President Jovenel Moïse in 2021. Gangs now control parts of the country. Reports come out regularly of, of the daily horrors that uh, Haitians have to, to live through. Uh, in, in the gang-controlled areas, uh, mass rapes, uh, repetitive mass rapes, uh, killings of all sorts, uh, police officers uh, getting killed and burned and having their body parts cut off. All this is prompting calls for a Caribbean-led security force to intervene, but Caribbean nations want outside help, including from Canada. What we in CARICOM have come to appreciate is that we do not have the resources to be able to deal with the Haiti problem ourselves, and we do need outside help. Before Trudeau left for the Bahamas, he had this to say. Uh, we're also going to be uh, talking seriously about Haiti. Uh, obviously, regional uh, support and regional participation in uh, all the work that Canada's doing down in Haiti is important. From those comments, it's not clear how Canada will be stepping up, but Trudeau has said any response to the ongoing situation must be Haitian-led. David Thurton, CBC News, Nassau.